good morning girls welcome back for the online session of english language yesterday we started our last topic advertisements under which we saw about the details how it is a kind of a tool for the marketing regarding any product so let us study more about it we observed like the activity of attracting public attention to a product or business as by paid announcements in the print broadcast or electronic media yes we have seen this like whatever product is new in the market for their publicity for their announcement whenever it is given in form of broadcast or through electronic media or in the form of newspaper through print or even in the magazines etc so it is the business or acting of making something known to the public that also we have seen and again it is always given in form of paid services then after we saw different advertisements right like i made you aware with the product and its punch line so today some of the still key elements which are remaining some of the short tips which are remaining to make your advertisement effective so let us do it first this is the format which i explained you right that we will discuss later now along with this few tips to make your advertisement effective number 1 use short sentences long sentences will not sell your ad people will forget the thing that about which you are talking let alone your product number 2 use different sentence structures maybe you have forgotten about this part like you can use affirmative you can use negative you can use interrogative you can use 
imperative these are the reference structures which you can use it third keep your and short close with a statement that calls your reader to action and the last is re read and rewrite if <clears throat> necessary so these are the things that you have to keep in your mind while writing the advertisement now let us frame one advertisement sample ad <clears throat> advertisement we are going to draft about the hains tomato ketchup hains tomato ketchup you might have heard about this product isn't it so we are going to draft this what we need is we need a kind of bordering but that we will do <coughs> later on always any <coughs> any products advertisement starts with a punch line so yes we should make an i catch a punch line <clears throat> you can use inverted comma no one grows catch up like hands this is an idea just here framed you can use your own one it's not like whatever the real punch lines are there or the catchy lines are there that only you can keep you can use any of yours your mind's creativity you can apply here so always it starts with a kind of punch line then after here you can put a kind of designing this part is made for the designing or else you can use at the center whichever the product related to that if designing is required a small piece of drawing you can use what else you can do then after you can write the features on the next part features or else you can write like benefits sometimes advantages qualities which makes your product more attractive so the buyer can buy the thing let's start with the first benefit
यूनिक इन टेस्ट विथ वेरियंस अवेलेबल ऑल ओवर द इंडिया थर्ड कंटेनिंग विटामिन्स एंड फ्लेवर्स freshly made to gratify appetite then you can write like it is made from organic process no preservatives preserve tubes and colors no one can beat for its thickness so this is what i think features or you can say benefits or you can say advantages regarding the hints we have discussed here then after you can provide certain type of benefits or uh, related to sale offers sale limited period offers seasonal sale depends upon the product you can apply seasonal sale so this about you can write here for hands i am providing or i have thought to give here is the special offer in hands like buy one and get to free again you can use your some kind of designing like if you want to draw if you want to make it convenient for the buyer so that buyer can have this thing it appeals to their mind directly and they are they become ready to buy it then you can provide contact details here you can write the 
agency name company name agent name email address even they can order online website details contact number so that would be easier for them to make contact for for the product to the concerned person this everything after that you can have this kind of bordering so that would be really helpful to understand that yes you are supposed to draw a kind of a box in which you are going to draw draw or write up, write down the things so this is what the thing which i wanted to say this is just a simple way to draft an advertisement there is no any particular format regarding this but yes definitely you have to take this five things in your mind and before that this is the structure accordingly you can go with that it starts with the i catch e line then you can put a question mark for example i can explain you the orally the other one like most of the people are suffering from the problem of obesity right you might have seen the pamphlets of that on which the first question is asked so tumhe dubda thava mango chho so tumhe attractive lagwa mango chho so tumhe tumaro figure maintain karva mango chho this is the question it directly appeals to the human psychology and reader will start thinking about that or that direction will be followed by the one who is reading then you can make some designing drawing related to the product add attractive features and benefits about the product then you can introduce certain offers to the customer and then at last you can go with the contact details right so this is all about the advertisement now you can have a practice on your own you can get multiple advertisements you can see on internet on social media write in the newspapers in form of pamphlets hoardings all the steps are used or all the forms are being used by the people to make product popular so again it varies from person to person because man differs mind differs so it can be a it can be anything as per the product or who is making that so i think girls this is all about the advertisements whatever things were needed i have provided you now regarding your syllabus if i say then we have done our chapters remaining chapters 6 7 8 9 10 is done from my side and the other part in form of composition under which we have cleared we have clearly solved all four topics all the material i have given to you almost except this about the advertisement which i have not given to you but this is comparatively an easier one so even you can have <coughs> on your own so hereby i'm ending the syllabus please make yourself comfortable regarding the syllabus if there is any query question any time you find you can contact me about that certainly you will have exams but when that things will be informed to you right so till that you can prepare yourself fully you can have revision of whatever videos are sent and along with that 
<coughs> you can prepare yourself for the question answers you can have a writing practice because i think you have lost that thing from some from some days due to this vacation mood and all i will be sending definitely an important questions list to you on tomorrow so in that you will find important questions from the text side and for the practice part i'll be giving you list reg regarding the advertisement products definitely you will have product advertisements if you type product advertisement then also you can have a list of products but i will make this thing simplify for you by giving you a list of product so we'll continue for the last session on tomorrow but that will be only related to the question answers and uh, the things which are required to be informed till that stay home stay safe thank you very much and have a good day